I think the importance of trade wins is that we bring all of the different countries in the Caribbean areas together and we partner up to do the same exact mission. Everyone's focusing on, for example, today we're rappelling and fast roping. Everyone's practicing fast rope with the same techniques and standards. So that way if there's a crisis or some kind of intervention or contingency that needs to uh, be responded to by anyone in the Caribbean, everyone can respond and work together for the same mission. I, I, think, it's, I think trade wins is great. I think we need to continue it. You know, we can, all these guys practice insert methods, whether it's parachuting, fast roping, rappelling, amphibious insert, or vehicle insert. Uh, they all do the same things, and we all do them as well. So I think it needs to continue to practice all the different ways we can get from A to B to uh, complete a mission. I think from the bottom to the top, what everyone should get out of is relationships, friendships. I mean, I've talked to people who already said that they're going to remember this exercise for the rest of their career. So I think as long as we can make that mark with everyone, that's a victory. The purpose of this track is to train all of the soldiers and troops and Marines to perform a mission. Everyone is trained to do it in the same manner, and that way we can all respond to contingencies in everyone's country um, or specific region in the Caribbean. I'd like to thank the Jamaican Defense Force for hosting the second phase of trade wins and the ministries that assisted into the smooth integration of participants into this exercise.